If you're fishing for silvers and the bite slows down, you should probably have some hoochies in reserve. And here's why. There we go. Fish on, baby. Yeah. What do we got? Okay. Uh -huh. We're doing the coho roll. Coho death roll. Toho death roll. I'm gonna loosen that drag. Wow. Toho death roll. For the most part, what I've found is that co-fishing is all about being low and slow with your lure presentation. Now when the bite dries up, I like to go to a hoochie and you're literally bouncing this pink squid in the face of a coho and they're already very aggressive and pissed off as it is. So if your spinners and your spoons aren't working, if you're bouncing a hoochie on top of their face, then it's just you might as well pack your bags up and go home if they don't bite. So, here's what you need. Pick you up some uh, Gamagatsu uh, octopus hook. I believe these are size two and I like using red. Uh, egg weight, they seem to work out great. They're real heavy. So if you're using a uh, braided line with a uni knot to fluorocarbon leader, you can really crank out some range and really do some precision uh, casting. So all I did was I picked out some sinkers in the store. I compared it to the package that I was buying, the squid skirts. I just lined it up with the head to make sure I was getting the right size egg sinker. That way you don't get something too small and it's annoying and it's falling out. And obviously you need a swivel which holds uh, everything together. And then uh, finally some leader. Maxima Ultra Green is awesome. 20 pounds probably a little heavy. That's not actually what I'm using with these rigs. These are 12 pound I believe. However 15 pound might be a good option too because it's a little bit stronger and it'll prevent uh, break off from uh, teeth. Tying the hoochie is very simple. You got your swivel, a line that passes through. To your hooks and your hook is what uh, prevents it from going through the, uh, the egg sinker so what you got to do is you got to tie your hooks first pass the bitter end of the uh, the line through the eye of the egg sinker and then you gotta like the, the tricky part is like adjusting the height of the the leader and tying it to your swivel and then you just uh, you know you slip the whole package into the uh, squid skirt and you're rocking and rolling so if you're bored during the winter and it's not salmon season crack open a beer throw a movie on and just crank out you know 10 of these and keep them in the tackle box they're they're freaking awesome uh, on the river as you can see in the video i uh, hope you guys enjoyed this hope it was helpful if you liked the video give it a thumbs up and uh subscribe if you guys so feel like it till next time. We'll see you later.